All right, well, if you plan on gifting or maybe hope to get a gift that involves lithium batteries, they can be a serious safety hazard. The batteries are highly flammable and can cause danger to you or your loved ones. Channel 3's Hector Molina is joining us right now to explain what products carry these batteries and how you can stay safe. Well, Mark, the products that have lithium batteries range from laptops, cell phones, to e-bikes, and even e-cars. Now, if you aren't careful with these batteries, this is what could happen fires that could go from dangerous to even deadly. Now here's what you should know when it comes to storing, charging, and handling these devices. Lithium batteries store a lot of energy, which makes it much easier for them to catch fire. If you happen to see any e-bikes, scooters, or laptops under your tree this year, here's what firefighters recommend you should do to safely enjoy your gift. Keep batteries devices at room temperature and do not place them in direct sunlight. Also, keep them away from anything flammable. And if a battery overheats or you notice an odor, change in shape or color, call 911 immediately. The Rocky Hill Fire Department uses lithium batteries for their drone. They showed us an example of a damaged battery. If you look right here on the uh, side, you can see that the casing is actually bulging out slightly. So this is actually a very minor case of it, but we're still not taking a chance of flying with a uh, battery that's damaged. And if you need to buy a new one, the Glastonbury Fire Department explained why it's important to buy the same battery from the same exact manufacturer. Need to replace the battery, make sure that you replace it with the exact battery that goes into that particular piece of appliance. There's a lot of aftermarket batteries that don't necessarily fit into the appliance that you purchase, which that can cause a fire. Chief Hers adds that these fires are much harder to put out, especially with electric cars. Just because there's no flames, it doesn't mean the fire's over. We're going to follow the uh, tow operator back to their facility. We're even telling them, hey, don't store it in your building. Put it out in your lot where it's far away from any other combustibles or away from the building because of the potential of a fire risk that could happen a couple hours or even a day later. Now, when you go to throw out those batteries, firefighters recommend to throw it in a hazardous wastebasket, not in the garbage or recycling. Hector Molina, Channel 3, Eyewitness News.